45 take one. Any film crew, feature, documentary, television or commercial has a routine they go through at the start of every shot. 46 take one. So why is it that when I'm about to perform for the camera, when my concentration has to be at its height, film etiquette demands that someone slams two pieces of wood together in front of my face? Could it be the perverse nature of film technicians the world over? No, there's a very practical reason for the clapperboard. It indicates the synchronisation of picture and sound. Right, now we're back in synchronisation again. And as you can see, the sound is recorded on a tape recorder which is entirely separate from the camera. Now, although they run in synchronisation with each other, the film editor needs a clear reference point of synchronisation for each shot. The clapperboard supplies that simply and effectively. 48, take four. On the picture, we can see the slate number and the take number. When the editor hears that slate number and take number on the soundtrack, she knows she has the right piece of sound to go with the right picture. The bang on the track and the frame of picture when the board is closed provides an exact point of reference for synchronisation. 48, take four. A responsible yeah, cameraman will be aware of the need for a clear clapper board and sometimes shout if he thinks he missed it. Not in frame, please, board. 51, take two, second clap. If you want, take two second clap. Action. Oh, sorry. OK, no, 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 no don't, don't worry about it, really. Um, it'll, it'll, it'll be OK this time. Sometimes there are technical or artistic reasons for putting the board on the end of the shot. If an artist is extremely nervous, or more likely, if the shot was grabbed in such a hurry that there was no time to put a board on the front of it. The soldiers everywhere! They put down 70 to mill last night. Board. If you two take one on the end. When this proves necessary, the board is held upside down as an indication that it is an end board. End boards are preferable to no board at all, but they do waste time in the cutting room and should only be used in an emergency. The soldiers everywhere! They put down something to mill last night. A clapperboard held like this in front of the camera indicates that the footage was shot mute, i.e. without synchronous sound. The sound recordist will normally provide wild tracks to accompany such pictures. 49, take one. Clapperboard is simple, low technology. Yet it plays a vital part in efficient filmmaking. It not only gives the film editor the information he needs, but it has a galvanic effect on location. When a shot is slated, crew, Artists and even onlookers know that the rehearsals are over and this one's for real.